recording. Yeah, this is Liam from The Prodigy and Keith from The Prodigy. Hi, uh, how you doing? And we're here for the big day out. Okay. That's all. So two years ago, what, what, what sort of progress has Prodigy made in two years and how have you changed? I hear live you guys going more... Well, we've, we've got a few new band members just joined. As you, so can you see the guy? Check the guy out over there with the, um, the purple arm. Can you give us a wave? That's our new um, percussion man. Um, there's a few other guys that are about the, you know, there's about nine of us now. Um, so, you know, we've, we've, it's going to be wild. We've got full brass section tonight. Um, you know, it's going to be big. It really is. And how, how are Prodigy changing musically? Um, We've gone more into for the country and western vibe yeah. now, haven't we? Do you know what I mean? And we we'll, we'll so figured that like most the line dancing is yeah. much more easier to yeah. get. Line oh. dancing's easier, you know. Basically, Maxim now shouts, you know, turn to the left, turn to the right, jump, do si do, that kind of yeah. thing. And, and I like I like a bit of the Irish vibe as well. It's yeah, sort of like, like this. Look. Can we do that, please? I really like that. I mean, Liam's now actually, as you can see, Liam is now dancing. And I'm actually on behind the keyboards, which you know it's a complete turnaround event, which is you know it's it's good, it really is. Okay, guys, last Thank time you. when I interviewed Liam, the most emotion I got was the British press. Absolute crap, you said. What, what, what are your thoughts of the British press now, two years on? Oh, we love them. I mean, we've, we've made so much money that we've actually brought most of the major newspapers. I own the enemy. Um, Liam owns the enemy. Um, I own Mix Mag and the Face. You know, so now we've earned some money, we can we can run it. You know, we own it. It's our shit. And being as famous as you are, photographers hanging out in trees and that, how, how does that affect you guys? Oh, well, you know, basically I just brought a big gun and I shoot them. Uh, you know, but the uh, same thing. They're most of them are my photographers, so I you know I get the best shots. <laughs> And uh, you got any wild stories you can share with us while we're here? Um, I was three or four girls in my room last night, wild sex, um, drugs, lots of, um, you know, there was a few animals involved, that's all I can say. Is it sex, drugs and rock and roll? Sorry? Is it sex, drugs and rock and roll being in prodigy? Or? Oh, every time, all the time, 24 hours, that's why I look like this. Okay, what's festivals like for you guys? Any uh, festivals here are cool. Um, Quite hot, actually. Very hot. Wasn't it? There's was lots of temperature, which was quite mad. Um, it's not sunny enough in Sydney. Needs a bit more sun, um, and that's about all I can say, really. Okay, you got any parting words that you can share to guys? Any party? Parting words. Parting. Oh, I've got one. <laughs> Did you catch that? I don't think the mic was actually working. But yes, um, parting words. Bailey Blanco from the Bronx, big in '96. Motherfucker.